When you think of high quality hot end and extruder components for 3D printing, E3D is one of the first that comes to mind. They're one of the oldest names in the desktop 3D printing industry with humble beginnings, crafting their first hot ends by hand using manual lathes. Today, their latest masterpiece is the precision engineered and manufactured E3D Himera that features dual drive extruder gears, an incredibly constrained filament path, modular mounting options, all while still integrating with the existing E3D V6 ecosystem. Let's break it down. For most 3D printers, the limiting factor for the speed 3D prints can be created is determined by the torque provided by the extruder. The 3D printer can get the nozzle hot enough, but the extruder just can't keep up. The Himera incorporates one of the shortest and most constrained filament paths we have seen produced for a 3D printer extruder, which works in tandem with the 3 to 1 gear ratio dual drive gears to provide supreme grip and control over 3D printed filament. We've even seen flexible materials printed at 3D printing speeds standard for rigid materials without even a hiccup, a notoriously challenging task. And with an adjustable idler tensioner, you can fine tune the grip depending on each material's needs. Himera is the latest addition to the V6 ecosystem, which means all of the existing E3D hot end components you already have will be easy to assemble and install. The new custom heat brake maintains compatibility with hot end components from the prolific E3D V6 to the E3D Volcano or Super Volcano. Simply assemble the hot end, screw in the heat brake, and tighten in the heatsink. No two 3D printers are built alike, and E3D understood that while designing the Himera, with slots for square nuts integrated into the front and back of the stepper motor, creating your own mounting surface to modify an existing printer is a breeze. E3D has been putting together a handy collection of guides for upgrading some of the most popular 3D printers and installing the Himera, or instead, use the mounting points for specific hardware installations like layer cooling fans or bed leveling probes. And because E3D doesn't want to leave anyone behind, you can use the Bow Adapter to convert the normally direct drive Himera into a Bowden compatible setup. If you're looking for a compact, feature rich, and all inclusive 3D printer component, the Himera is the extruder for you. To learn more and to order your Himera dual drive extruder today, go to matterhackers.com. Hey there, thanks for watching our tech breakdown on the E3D Himera. I can't overstate enough how awesome of an upgrade this is on all the 3D printers that I've put it on, and the mounting holes on the side make it such an easy upgrade process. If you want to read some in depth articles, you can go to matterhackers.com, or to stay up to date with all of our digital manufacturing content, be sure to click subscribe. See you in the next one.